Hi and welcome to the video. This is the second in the comparison of the kits. Um, as you can see I've put the frames together uh, and done the decks all bar the Billings boat um, as I've got a few issues which I'll go through in a bit. Um, but as you can see the Okra and the Artisana Latina pretty similar. One dry fitting, um, the okra one was a lot looser. Um, and I'm not sure if the camera can pick this up, you can see gaps down the side of the ribs. And the Artana Latina is quite a tight fit. Um, and as you can see, there's no gaps. The thing with the Artisana Latina, which shows, shows on the camera here, the deck actually arches. So that's more realistic compared to the Okra one, which is just flat. So if there was water to get on it, it would just lay on the okra one and whereas in real life it would drain out through some drains. So extra points there for Artisana Lutena. Right. With the actual build, um, the instructions do say on the um, Artisana Lutena to actually fit the deck and then plank it. I, I do find it easier to plank it and then fit it afterwards. Uh, the, there is, however, a slight issue with this one. I'll line it up. Wrong way around. Right. The deck needs to be bent, which is not an issue, but it's supposed to line up, you can't really see that, there's a hole there, which is to go over this, but it doesn't really want to go. So I'm going to have to do some minor adjustments there to make that fit. The Oprah one, as you can see, the, there's little nibs on each of the ribs. They correspond to the nibs on the deck. So if we can get this the right way around. And it's just a case of lining them up. That one's relatively easy. Uh, when doing the deck, you can see all the little holes. It's just a bit more fiddly than this one. Right, the approximate time to build these, it's probably about 10, 15 minutes. The, the length of time is actually longer because you have to fit the rib, straighten it, let the glue dry before you can move on to the next one. 
So they're approximately 10 to 15 minutes to build, but obviously several hours waiting for glue to dry. Whereas this one on the other hand, that took all of 30 seconds. Just pulled it out of the box. What I found with the Billings one, the instructions, despite there being some nice images, the actual instructions on the kit are terrible. Right, the extent of the written instructions in English is that <laughs> uh, basically the first part is uh, make sure you clean the hole before you start working on it. Uh, and then the second bit is gluing the deck to the hole. The third bit is you've got to Sand this down so it's four millimeters. And then it goes on to fitting a stern rail. Drilling holes. And then a frame consisting of strip number 21 must be glued to onto the deck. Where the companion ladder, hatch and cabin. That's on here. Are molded. And strip number 27 can now be positioned and lacquered over a forward companion ladder. Deck fittings such as shrimp boiler sleeve can now be fitted. But nowhere does it tell you what to use and where. So that, that is the extent of the English instructions. And then you've got diagrams to try and figure it out. But the worst bit, you go to the parts list. So the, the deck for here is made up This part here goes on top of there. That one goes on there. Um, I think there is one for here, or supposed to be. It's then planked with some of this. But when you look at the instructions, deck part number 19 nowhere is there anything listed as part number 19 right, okay we can uh, come down we've also got English ones. Deck strip. Part number 26. 0 0.7 millimeters thick by three wide by 250 long. There is no timber here for that. Initially I thought it was these parts, but they're 0.4 thick. They're the right width. The 270 mil long. Now you've got these parts again, about four mil, uh, 0.4 mil thick, two mil wide. So that's not the right one. So this kit is just a complete joke. I'm going to end up having to. Um, 
Yes.